Hello my dear students and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's lesson, I will be teaching on a very important aspect of chemistry which is called preparations of acids. Now, the preparation of acids can be made possible by some processes. Okay, now the first one I'm talking on is by direct combination of the elements. Now, the first one is direct combination of elements. Okay, now let's take some example like when hydrogen okay reacts with chlorine, it gives us hydrochloric acid. Okay, now the catalyst being used here is called activated charcoal. Activated charcoal. Okay, so this is a first process or a first method of producing an acid by direct combination of the elements. Now, an, another process okay, of forming an acid is by dissolving an acid anhydride in water. Okay, by dissolving an acid anhydride in water. Now, what are acid anhydrides? Acid anhydrides are non-metallic oxide which when dissolves in water produces an acid. Now, examples of this acid anhydride we have is NO2, we have CO2. So all of these are examples of acid anhydride. Now, for example, CO2 dissolves in water. Okay, CO2 dissolves in water. So what we are getting is H2CO3, okay, H2CO3, and H2CO3 is called carbonic acid, it's called carbonic acid, it is a weak acid, okay, now, dissolving NO2 in water, we get NO2 being dissolved in water, okay, we get two acids, two acids, the first acid is HNO2, and the other is HNO3. Okay, this is called nitrous acid, while this is called nitric acid or aqua fortis. So, an acid can be formed by dissolving an acid and nitride in water and also by direct combination of the elements. My name is Brett Edo, and thanks for watching.